We're going to take you on a family road trip to Sevierville, Tennessee at the Wilderness of the Smokies. So let's check it out. We are sitting poolside at the Wilderness of the Smokies here in Sevierville, Tennessee. Way full. You can see, this is one of their, their indoor pools. They got several attractions for little kids, big kids, white pools, indoor, outdoor, uh, jacuzzi style. They got something that you can go up on a raft and uh, swirl around, come back down inside. They got a lazy river on the outside, along with several other connecting properties that go with the wilderness or the Wyndham. If you haven't been down here to check this place out, Pigeon Forge has a ton of attractions. Now I've thought about moving down here a few dozen times myself. Now we're getting dried off here. We're gonna go through the, the game room right there. We're gonna order some Mamma Mia's pizza and try it out. Just look at the game room here. This is right outside the pool, just in this one area. And the kids love this sort of stuff. They can literally climb up to the roof and walk across the ladders, the ropes, the whole nine yards. They got games galore. You know, you want a fun place to take your kids, man. It's well worth staying at the wilderness. Buy a timeshare. We got a timeshare last year and I paid $300 for a $2,000 unit. It comes with stove, beds, refrigerators, everything you might need. And everything's right down the road. Like we went to Ripley's, believe it or not, went to the aquarium, Hollywood Wax Museum, everything. Then they got the big glass bridge you can look through, wilderness forest adventures. I mean, you name it, they got pretty much anything you could want down here for family oriented events. And uh, pamphlets for everything. These are three of my girls though. Y'all have fun swimming? Yeah. Yes. Yes. You love coming here? Yeah. Yes. We're gonna come back again, ain't we? Yeah. Yes. Absolutely. Everly, if two little twins pop out and want you to come play with them, uh, let us know how it goes. Now, if y'all ain't never heard of Mama Mia's Pizza, this is what the cheese looks like. They got these amazing rolls right here. And this is a mamma jamma of a salad. You want a chicken salad? That's a salad. And this is what their pepperoni looks like. And this has got some pepperoni, bacon, and banana peppers, baby. This looks like some good eating right here. Now, what you're looking at is a presidential suite that you can get through the Wyndham. At some point in time in a future video, I will go through the step-by-step -step process on what you should expect if they ever approach you about becoming an owner. Because you can actually become an owner through Wyndham in which you will get a ton of points every year. And you can basically travel around the world. And instead of using money all the time, you can use those points to get your rooms, to get your food, whatever the case may be. They've even got some offers where you can utilize points to pay for your flights depending on where you're going at around the world. Wyndham is by far one of the biggest companies worldwide that owns some of the most luxurious resorts in the world. Like I said, that's for a later date and time. We will go through the step-by-step -step process on that. I just wanted to show you all exactly what the presidential suite looks like because this is absolutely amazing. They got two beds in just about every room that they got. They got the showers, the jacuzzi tub, the hot tub. It's fully stocked with towel soap, refrigerator, cookware, washer, dryer. Anything you need, they're going to have it in these presidential suites. And another thing I thought was pretty impressive is the fact that whenever you walk into some of these buildings, the air quality is totally different. That's because they have stated the art air filtration systems in place. You are getting the best quality air available whenever you go into one of these buildings. And as you can see, the view here is absolutely amazing. Typically, if you're looking down there, you'll see the lazy river that'll be filled plumb up full of water and there'll be a ton of people in it at any given time. Across the way here, there is a whole different resort that is actually attached to the Wyndham. So you can go from one resort to the next if you come down here and stay at one of these places. You show up, bring whatever food you want, go shopping at your local stores nearby, pick up whatever food you need while you're there. You're going to save a ton of money not going out to eat every night. Not the indoor attractions that your kids can run wild on go-karts ripley's believe it or not there's all kinds of dinner shows you can attend like the pirates of the caribbean the hatfield mccoy's the comedy barns right down the road you stay a full two or three weeks down here in the pigeon forge area and you can travel and see just about everything and still have stuff left over to do and if you wanted to take a little bit of a day trip go visit chattanooga tennessee ruby falls rock city all that sort of stuff it's not that far away stay tuned to the next video coming up we will go over all the things you should expect if you want to become a wyndham owner if this sort of content you want to see more like it make sure you pop the clutch and that subscribe button, comment down below, check out all these social media platforms, and I'll see you next time.